I understand that for most of y'all, this wouldn't be a popular decision, but I'm looking at it from Roland's point of view. The man is trying to save his world from falling into oblivion, and because of this, he's willing to sacrifice a few in order to save the many, and possibly turn back the hands of time in order to undo what happened to his beloved Gilead long ago. I think if I were in his position, I would probably do the exact same thing. This isn't like one of those silly superhero stories where you know the protagonist will go on a formulaic hero journey so he or she can fight whatever the PG-13 monster of the week is in order to fulfill some dumbass requirements for a generic redemption arc, just so everybody can laugh, smile, and get a reach around at the end of the movie. No, this is the story of a broken man trying to save a dying world, and if he has to sacrifice the life of a child, his quartet, or a thousand other souls to do it, then that's what the man's gonna do. The reason I love the Dark Tower series, and stories like it, is because it's about realistic people making incredibly hard decisions that may or may not be the right one, and the choice they made was the necessary choice at the time they made it. That speaks more to the integrity of the writer than the writer creating some heartwarming decision just so the reader thinks Roland's a really good guy. Hard choices are called hard choices because they're fucking hard. This existence we call life was never meant to be easy, and it never will be, no matter what the circumstances we face. We welcome you to visit the Darker Shades of Black podcast, where we explore various fictional works revolving around the darker aspects of man's inner nature. Please like and subscribe to this program wherever you listen to your favorite podcast. Thank you.